Washington, D.C. is known for having one of the highest rates of HIV in America. 3% of its residents have the virus. An astounding 26% raise in the rate since 2006. But a brand new drug may change that. So PrEP is, stands for pre-exposure prophylaxis. It is essentially a once daily pill taken to prevent HIV infection. Uh, it uses an existing HIV treatment medication called Truvada. But it's used for people who are HIV negative to keep them HIV negative. The analogy that seems most mm, comfortable for people is to say it's sort of a birth control pill for HIV. Back in 2012, the FDA approved the new drug in an effort to prevent the virus. When taken every day, PrEP is an extremely safe and highly effective way of preventing HIV. I mean, I think that there's some mythology out there um, that we're still trying to understand uh, that people who go on PrEP engage in riskier sex or more frequent sex or that they abandon condom use altogether. Uh, the recommendation is to use PrEP in conjunction with condoms. Um, but we know that people don't use condoms routinely. PrEP is no cheap drug. It can cost about $1,800 a month without insurance. So make sure you're checking with your health care provider to make sure that you're covered. People who were going to early adopt PrEP have early adopted it, right? It's people who are, you know, white, privileged, have lots of health literacy and access to insurance, etc. Um, and so now we actually need to do a better job getting other people educated about PrEP. So share information about it if you do go on it. There's tons of information on the internet, um, on the web. Um, you know, there are certainly lots of places to go in D.C. for PrEP. One thing to remember is PrEP is not the cure for HIV. It is to be used in conjunction with healthy, safe practices to prevent HIV contraction. For more information, you can visit Whitman-Walker.org. For Howard University News Service, this is Devin Jones.